So, hi guys. Back again. I'm about to go gun shopping right now. Um, now there's a lot of concern out there. Um, my town is fine. As you can see, I don't know if you can see, but it's a long line at Starbucks right now. Drive through only. Um, we're good. It's a lot of panic, but besides cases and stuff, we're fine. But everybody is getting prepared because we know it's going to hit our little town. And spring break people are coming back um, as we speak. Um, so we know it's coming sometime in this week. So everybody just getting prepared. We still doing Every, Walmart's still crowded, everything, even shelves empty, shelves are empty, but, you know, we still gotta get prepared, so I'm about to go pistol shopping, gun shopping, so I'm gonna bring y'all along with me, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to record in the store, but right now, I'm at Starbucks, getting me some coffee, I already had my breakfast, and I'm gonna get this shit popping, like, everybody can get a pistol, <laughs> like, and I already got one, so I need to, just in case. You know, motherfucker want to act up. But let me get this coffee. Say, um, ice caramel coffee, um, no sugar, heavy whipping cream, and four spenders. So I'm in the mall. It's empty. Looks like the only shield is open in the food court. But she was closing stores up in the gun store. But I'm about to go meet up with this girl in the food court. All right. See. When I went to Starbucks, I paid with my Fills app. Fills is a place, an app that you could buy gift cards from. So instead of handing up cash, I did that. And then I used a. a Wipe the wipe off my cup. Hey, there you go. <laughs> We're going gun shopping. Dun dun dun. Hey, baby. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, I wasn't able to show you in the store what I got, but here we go. This is what I got. And I'm going to show y'all some other stuff. But. Here you go. This will come with it. A little lock. Safety measure. Let's put the camera up a little bit more. Nine. So, I won't be leaving the house no more because we got food to last like a month, <laughs> maybe longer. Got our protection of being, you know, we got our protection. And let me show you what I got with this. And don't worry, I have a gun safe. Already that the other gun is in. Oh yeah. And then clip. Extra clip. There's two clips. One in the gun and one on the side. And besides that. This is what everybody should have in their house. Okay. Bullets. Um, my friend husband, he helped me pick out the gun. He's been in the um army military. So he picked out these bullets and he put this out for me. The oil the gun and I guess these one of the top bullets. He said this is under the one that he would normally buy. Because he know I already had, let's switch it out, I already had these bullets, 
it's upside down. But I already have these bullets. Okay. 200 of them. For the pink gun. So he got these. Because he said these is better. So. I got these. He said these go in the gun first. So I got these. And my backup. Bullets. So, if you can't get a gun because your background or just don't have the money to go get a gun, your next bet is to go in your kitchen and find a sharp knife. Now, this knife, it looks a little dirty, but this knife I keep in my room. I keep one of these in my office. I normally keep knives around the house. I am a single parent. And I'm a Kubana. So, I keep knives around the house. And I normally keep knives like this around the house. Okay? It's a stainless steel knife. I got this at Dollar Tree. I know it's kind of dirty. I know I should have washed it. But, fuck it. It's emergencies. So... You get the knife out your kitchen. You just put them around your house. That's what I do. So if you can't get a gun, get knives. Knives don't run out of bullets. They do have to be close for you to use it, but you know, safety. And one thing I do will say get. This is at Dollar Tree too. It is one, two, three, four, five. Five, so it's ten boxes of matches. I don't know how to set a fire, okay? If shit get rough and get real, real quick, and we got to go in these damn woods and shit, because you know I stay, I stay in the middle of no man's land. If I got to go in these woods, I'm going to have to start a fire. So, we got some fire. It's 32 in each box, and this is... 10 boxes, so that should last a long, long time. Even if I use one match a day, it's 32 of it, and that's a month. And two extra days is sometimes one extra day. You know, if it's February, it's a lot of extra days, so this is real good. My next thing is now, now look it. I'm not in Vegas, but I used to be in Vegas, and I used to drive these buckets, and I used to cause tape the world out the car, out of a car. Yes, I did say out of a car. I used to make the car brand new with tape. So this is back up. You cut yourself, you better tape yourself up. You need the tape up, like the plastic that you covering up in the woods. Or however. You need to tape somebody up. You need tape. You need scotch tape. Heavy duty. You need it. You know, two times the strength. Guess what? This was that Dollar Tree. This was that Dollar Tree. And this knife was that Dollar Tree. So, my pocket knife is in the car. And I didn't feel like getting it out the car. But, say this is my pocket knife. At Dollar Tree, they have pocket knife that's... Regular pocket knives, it has the can opener and all that. Ladies, we could put the pocket knife in our boobies, okay? It closes up, it ain't gonna cut us. You could put it on the side of your boobie, under your boobie, in the middle of your boobies. If you ain't got no boobies, you could put it on the side under your arm, you know? And if it get rough where you think they gonna check, I don't know the scenarios. But you know you could put it on top of your cooler. I'm just saying. Always be careful. And the pocket knife is about this big and about that's why it's some at Dollar Tree. If you want a better one, it's some at Walmart. It's some I got the gun at Shields. It's a whole lot at Shields. Shields is in a lot of malls, so go ahead. They got discounts and everything. Go to Shields, look for a pistol. Go to the pawn shop, look for a pistol. Just find out a pistol. If not, pick up a whole bunch of knives. All right? That's all I'm saying. A light. I need a light. We need a light. We don't know what's going on, and nobody want to be in the dark. 
Okay, nobody want to be in the dark. So I got I got a whole bunch of these. And then I have little batteries. I have medium batteries. And I have big batteries. Just in case because I have a whole bunch of these. I have flashlights. I got a lot of stuff that needs batteries. And I have batteries, okay? And the light came from Dollar Tree. The batteries come from Dollar Tree. So, make sure y'all ready for this. Just be ready. Be ready. Just go around your house and see what you have. I know for sure y'all got more than five knives in your house. Okay? So, just be ready. Be prepared. And stay safe. And I'm ready. Now, I don't have to leave the house. I'm going to try to make more videos. Um, If y'all want to see more videos, let me know. Because I could. Girl. Yes. Yes, we good. I brought, I got more stuff than this, but this is like the basics. This is just like safety protection basics. But I have more. If y'all want me to do another video, I got y'all. I got y'all. All right. But make sure if you can get a gun, make sure you have a knife. If you can get a gun, still have your knife. If you can't get that, get you a pocket knife. Like a pocket knife. Make sure it has everything, you know, the knife, the bottle opener, all that, all the, all the kinks up in there, okay? But thank God for sticking in. Thank you for watching the video, and we all good. We believe in the. I believe in my Lord. That made me pull out my deal. What she saying? God may still. <laughs> come on now, come on now. But have a nice day. Have a blessed day, and. I love you all. Be safe. Um, I've been in the house locked up for a week. I went out, made y'all the video yesterday. I went out today to make sure I got my pistol, and I'm good. I'm in the house, all gravy. Not going out, and we ain't even been affected. Like, like I said, we have one, two cases, but that's it. Like, and they all just flew in. Like, so. I'm good. No more in the house. And I don't work no more. I work at the college. They shut us down. So, we good. But, be safe. Love you. You know. Good, good. Bye-bye.